But to answer your question about the Karen that I spoke to in real life uh, at the anti-mask protest, basically, so here's the thing. At the anti-mask protest, I was nervous, right? Because, I mean, to put it simply, I was going to an anti-mask protest wearing a mask. Literally, I was going to the protest doing the thing they were protesting against. Just to, just to like set the scene for you, I'd never filmed in public before. I mean, I'd done filming once in public before, but apart from that, never filmed in public before. I was nervous, okay? And the, the people I was with was Finn, who was here earlier. He was filming for me and this other guy, James, who was also filming. And they were trying to like, they were trying to like edge me on to be like, all right, come on, George, you've got to do this, you've got to go interview people. And they put, we literally, I tried to interview this person. They walked past, I was like, can I interview you? They just ignored me. And this woman walked past me and they were like, George, interview her, interview her. And I was like, uh, do you want to interview me? Not, not, do you want me to interview you? And she just walked on and then I chased her and I was like, hello, hello. And then she spoke to me. So I was nervous. I, I wish I could have like done more jokes um, because it was, it was, I, I was kind of scared. I'm not going to lie. Uh, like the people were aggressive. Um, they were really aggressive, but I wish I could have like trolled them a bit better. I think it went okay though, but she was going on about so much nonsense. She was like, she wasn't even talking to me. She was talking to the cameraman. She called me stupid. No, she didn't call me stupid. She called me, uh, what did she say I was? She said, oh, what did she say I was? She was like, I, oh, she said, do you value your freedom? I was like, yeah, I think I do. And she was like, no, you don't. You're wearing a mask. I was like, why ask me something and then tell me the answer? Um, but yeah, she was crazy, honestly. She was like, she literally, I literally was like to her, do, can you not wear a mask? She was like, no, I can't wear a mask. If I wear a mask, I start walking into walls. And then when she said that, she was like, I start walking into wall, And then she stopped because I was like, I was gonna, I was, if, if she said that, I would be like, are you wearing your mask over your eyes? <laughs> because, how, and then she was like, it's a deeply, it's a deeply emotional experience for me. I'm like, wearing a mask is not a deeply emotional experience. How is it a deeply emotional experience? It's so, it's so crazy, like, <clears throat> The, the people there were insane. Like, I get they were all very much like, <clears throat> I, I, I could get this thing in terms of like, um, the right to protest, but if you're gonna protest, wear a mask. Obviously they wouldn't because they're anti-mask protests. But like, for example, um, the woman that died in London that got killed by the police officer, like fair enough protest for that. Black Lives Matter, protest for that. Cause they're like actual worthy things. Um, but when it comes to anti-mask protests, just grow up a bit, you know, just grow up. It's, just wear a mask, it's not 